these adorable macaroni sandwich things. I'm not really sure what they're called, but I'm just gonna call it macaroni sandwiches. Um, and then I'll teach you guys how to make this super adorable um, kawaii roll cake. Uh, I really love this recipe. I make this all the time. Um, so I hope you guys like it. All right, so let's get started. So for this recipe, we are gonna need two thirds cup of almond meal, one and a half cups of powdered sugar, three egg whites at room temperature, five tablespoons of sugar, one teaspoon of vanilla, one half, one fourth teaspoon of cream of tartar, and some pink food coloring or whatever food coloring you would like. But you are left with this, have this kind of powdery look. All right guys, so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna do the meringue. And for this, we are going to add our teaspoon of vanilla extract and um, our one fourth teaspoon of our cream of tartar. Mix this on medium speed. We're gonna add our sugar little by little. You don't wanna add the whole thing because that's gonna break it and we are not gonna have the stiff peaks that we want. All right, so now that you have something that looks like this, we are going to add um, our food coloring. Um, and mine is pink, as you can see here. Uh, yours doesn't have to be pink, but yours can be purple or blue or yellow or green. Uh, whatever color you want, um, but I love pink, so I'm gonna make mine pink. Now we are going to increase the speed to about seven um, to make this nice and fluffy. All right guys, so you just have something that looks like this. Uh, it looks very fluffy and it makes this kind of curved thing right here. Now we are going to sift in our almond and powdered sugar mixture. All right guys, so now we are gonna fold in um, our almond and powdered sugar mixture with our egg white mixture. All right guys, so you want something that looks like this um, and you want it to kind of drip like this, like they say molten lava. You're ready and you can start piping now. So your macros should be ready to bake once you touch them and they don't stick to your fingers. So All right, so now we are going to bake these on a 320 Fahrenheit for 20 minutes. All right guys, so for our rolled cake, we are going to need a cup of cake flour or normal flour. We're going to need a half cup of water, six tablespoons of sugar, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, uh, four tablespoons of oil. We're going to need six eggs. And for the eggs, we want all of them. We want the egg yolks and the egg whites. Then we're going to need, for our meringue, we're gonna need four tablespoons of sugar and a half teaspoon of cream of tartar. All right guys, as you can see here, I have separated my six egg whites and my six egg whites. Now I'm going to put my sugar. Something that looks like this. So now we are going to add our water, our oil, and then we're gonna add our vanilla extract. Okay, right, so now we are going to sift in our cake flour or our um, normal all-purpose flour. So now we are going to mix all this up. So your batter should look like this, a nice um, pale yellow color. All right guys, so now we're gonna do our meringue and we're gonna do the same thing we did for our macaroons. So we are going to add our cream of tartar. And we already added our vanilla extract to our egg yolk batter, we're not gonna add it here. something that looks like this. Um, it looks the same as the pink meringue that we did before for the macro, uh, except it looks white. Guys, so now we want to fold in our meringue with our egg yolk mixture. Here we have one fourth teaspoon of water and we're gonna add um, some food coloring. I like pink, um, you guys already know that, so I'm gonna add some pink. Okay, so now we're gonna get some of our batter um, and we're gonna put it in here. Right here I have five tablespoons of our batter and I am going to add the food coloring mixture thing I did before, which is this right here, and I'm gonna add it to it. And then we're gonna mix. What we're gonna use to make our polka dot pattern. Okay, so now we're gonna bake this on 325 for a minute. 
guys. So this is what you want. It looks like this when it gets out of the oven. Now this is just to make sure that when you put the batter, this won't fade away. So this is how it should look. I'm gonna bake this on 325 for 15 minutes. All right guys, so right here I have uh, three cups of heavy cream and I'm gonna add a cup and a half of my powdered sugar. So this is our baked cake. And now we are going to add our strawberries and our whipped cream. So this is my finishing product. I think it looks so cute. Uh, I worked really hard on it. Uh, and I'm pretty sure you guys can achieve this too. So please make sure to subscribe and like this video. So uh, if you guys want me to make more of these types of videos, please let me know.